Hi everybody, this is Ed. Thanks for coming to our ladies clinic. Melissa and I are doing these videos so you have a point of reference forever. You'll be able to download these links on my YouTube channel and um, get your refresher uh, for how to swing and we'll cover putting and chipping as well as we go through our four week class. Um, one thing to understand, I have my driver here, I have a six iron and I have a sand wedge. Um, understand that the clubs aren't built the same and so our distance away from the ball is different, different with each club. We always basically want to be the same distance away from the handle end and it should point somewhere around my belly button. But then as the club sole flat on the ground, the heads of the clubs are different distances away. So it's very important to set up to each club the way that club is meant to be set up to. If you don't learn anything else from me but that, that's a pretty good thing to know, okay? The other thing that's very important to learn to know is what our body's job is in the swing and what our hand's job is. We'll do a separate video on grip, stance, and setup, and so we'll talk about posture and all that in a little bit. But if I do a belly button drill where I place the club in my belly button and choke my hands out comfortably, as I turn 90 degrees back and then 180 through, this is my body's job in the swing, is to make the club swing around. My hand's job in the swing is to make the club swing up and down. And so, as I set up and I turn to this position, and then I hinge my hands up, the blend of that is what swings the club on the correct angle and strikes the ball. So, understand that that's very important that our hands hinge up and that keeps the club face square during our swing. Most new players, their concept of hitting a ball is to hit it with their hands and make their hands make the club go around. If I do that, the problem with that is, is my hands work like this on the backswing and the club points up in the air, which is actually a very closed position. So it makes it very difficult to get the ball up in the air and to hit it straight. Everything kind of goes low left into the ground. So understand how our body works and understand how our hands hinge is very important. The last body part that's important to understand is our elbows. If I hold the club level to the ground and I keep it level and let my hands hinge, you can see my right arm is folded and my left arm is straight. I'm a right-handed player. And then on the way through, my left elbow is folded and my right arm's pretty straight. That's exactly what happens in the golf swing. As I turn back and hinge, my right arm gets folded, my left is straight, and then I fold my left on the finish. Learn how to use your elbows, learn how to use your wrists, and learn how to use your body, and you'll become a great player. Thanks.